Good morning guys, we're just about to head off. This is a little bit different for Travel Tour Taste, but we thought that we would share it on Travel Taste with you. Um, what we're gonna do, I've got a bit of filming for Sky TV, um, a couple of days up in Southampton, near Winchester, so just the other side. It's about 45 miles away. So me and Sarah, we're just gonna pop up there, have a bit of lunch, and then we'll go on to set. And I'm really looking forward to it. I haven't done anything like this in about 10, 15 years, because the acting side of things has gone done and dusted and, and we thought that you know something a little bit different and what goes on down in the south there's a lot of filming that does go on in the south of England so we're really looking forward to bringing that to you um, on, on this video it is going to be a short one because I don't know how much of the filming Sarah's going to be able to do of us filming if you know what i mean but stay tuned i'm sure it will be even if it's only three four minutes long it will be exciting so see you all very soon we're off to southampton this is a car that's being used for the set of um the tv show that glenn's in but this case is for don miller so i don't know whether this is the detective's car or whether this is actually don's miller or replica of don miller's car but as you can see, they're filming up there now. So it's a little bit of behind the scene of what's going on in the show that Glenn's gonna, going to be in. I can't zoom in anymore. I want to get closer, but I don't want to interrupt them filming. So, but exciting. <laughs> Were they even filming that one? <laughs> no, we're, we're probably in shot. <laughs> might have been me in shot, mightn't it? So what you're seeing here is um, an outside view, obviously. Um, this was being filmed where we were doing house-to-house -house checks and questioning anybody if they saw anything suspicious that happened on the day. There is the major detective, the head detective. And of course, I was playing his assistant it was a fairly chilly day and you know done on a fairly small budget but when you see it on sky tv on the channel sky crime um the case of don miller and it's the world's most evil killers um for a small budget they do extremely well indeed so this shot that you're watching right now had to be taken about six or seven times just from different angles so they could cut away we also have pictures of just the books our notebooks our pens our handles and all of this was improvisation as well so literally we were making it up as we went along and sort of bouncing off each other which made it interesting and over seven takes you just really didn't know what each other was going to say at that particular time so there was a fair bit of banter going on between the two of us as well and he was a really nice guy no his name is max um a really great guy and we've kept in touch ever since so i hope you've enjoyed the video this far hello everyone this is sarah from um travel tour taste so i'm just going to give you a little tour of the room that we stayed in last night basically it's it's something that we found on the internet glenn found on the internet it's off of terminal terrace which is called the roost i think it's i believe it's called the roost um it was 70 pound for the well 68 pound for the evening but then you have to pay for your parking uh the car park is directly opposite and the car park for overnight cost us eight pounds so that was from till eight o'clock in the morning so i'm just going to give you a little tour of the room and um let you see the state of what we stayed in or the good state of what we stayed in so let me just flip this camera around. So this is the actual room. So this is the view when you first come in. So you've got a little clipboard there with all the information. Uh, you've got your bed. 
basically it's not big it's not a big room for 68 pound for the evening uh me and glenn said that we would much prefer to stay in a premiere inn but this was close to where we had to film so this is why we got this one um it's just off of terminal terrace and bernard street it's called the roost and we got that from online um which is about a five minute walk to ocean village so not too bad overall because glenn has to do filming in ocean village today um you've got two two tables um one with a remote control and both of the table have got little lamps and then switch around here this is your little kitchen area so to speak um with your condiments tea coffee sugar um milk some little earplugs there and they do supply you with two spoons two cups and two glasses um i did go to the shop and bought some extra milk and sugar because there wasn't enough you've got a kettle there's two wine glasses there and a fan um and then you've got some cupboards there um and the bottom cupboards you can't get into them because they've put the desk right in front so there is a coat stand um a fairly reasonable sized TV, I guess. Not your not your biggest TV. And then you've got a window, and this is our view. Not the greatest for seventy pound an evening. Not the greatest at all. You've got a radiator. It was absolutely freezing when we got here. Couldn't turn the radiator on, so I don't think they've switched it on downstairs um, because it might be too early on in the year. They do supply you with two bath towels, two hand towels and a bath mat or shower mat. So when you come out of the shower, this is en suite. So here is our bathroom. we have just put the light on for you. So here's our bathroom. So you've got basic shower, which Glenn says is absolutely fine. So, and then we've got a mirror with me. <laughs> and then they do supply you with I think that's body wash, shampoo, conditioner, and two soaps. And then there is a towel heater, a towel, towel rack to put your towels on. And they do supply you with two toilet rolls. Overall, it's not too bad. It's clean, it's tidy, it's fresh. Um, and it's somewhere to put your head down. So that, guys, is a view. Of our room that we stayed in Southampton Terminal Terrace just off of Bernard Street and Canute Street anyway guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed the tour speak to you soon take care god bless love and light always well there you go guys what a fantastic couple of days that was a lot of fun like I said at the beginning of the video I haven't done any filming for a long long time um, Met some lovely people, worked with some lovely people as well, you know, exchanges of numbers. Hopefully they'll want to use me again. So if you want to catch it as well, it's going to be released. What it is, it's on Sky Crime and Pick TV. And it's regarding a serial killer from America called Don Miller. And it's going to be on general release from the 16th of November because they're just a, a few weeks behind at the moment so thank you so much for joining us I hope you enjoyed the video I had a, a marvellous couple of days and so did Sarah and um, we'll catch up with you on the next one Travel.